Dr. Raman, forget about the BJP, forget about the Enforcement Directorate. The India block, which Mr. Kejriwal is committed to, in that block there is a party called the Congress. There is a party called the TMC. Both Congress and TMC have found themselves on the wrong end of the Enforcement Directorate. Kejriwal has never come out and supported any of those people, in fact supported the Enforcement Directorate. Let me also say, from the Congress there is an individual called Mr. Ajay Markan. I am sure you have heard of Mr. Ajay Markar. He is the senior most Congress leader yes. in the union capital where the AAP has a government. And what did he say about Mani Sisodia? He said, and I quote him, open and shut case of corruption, unquote. The two leaders, and he is talking about Sisodia and Kejriwal, are deeply involved in corruption. This is a Congress saying it an ally. So, where is the argument here? Uh, first of all, Okay, um, Rahul, first of all, the Congress and the Aam Aadmi Party um, were not allies and they have only come together and they are still not allies at the state level. They are purely coming together as part of the India Alliance to defeat the BJP in one particular election, full stop. So, I think that this is not, doesn't seem to be very clear when we say Mr. Khera has been arrested. Congress and AAP are not in alliance in Punjab or not, uh, they are not saying that we will, uh, you know, merge our parties in Punjab. They are not saying that. Now, let us look at the facts very clearly. One, I think uh, uh, the, uh, from an India Alliance perspective, this uh, arrest of Mr. Sanjay Singh is welcome because it will push Mr. Kejriwal even closer to the India camp. So, the second point, I do not know whether you have just seen a breaking uh, news where Mr. Mm. Sharad Pawar said, Mr. Kejriwal, that he has had a discussion with Mr. Kejriwal and Mr. Kejriwal has even said, he is not averse to conceding three seats in Delhi out of the seven to the Congress party to contest in 2024. So, I think that things are uh, going rather too well for the India Alliance at the moment, which is why okay. we need to come up with, oh, they won't stick together. AAP and Congress are fighting. Imagine TMC this. and Congress are fighting. Rahul, imagine this. Will collapse one second, and one BJP second. will win. One second, please. I think there is finish. some kind of panic now. Okay, but Dr. Raman, one second. Let me finish, Rahul. One second, let's I think speak over each other. Let, Dr. let Raman me finish. finish. Let, yeah. Yes. Yeah, let, yeah. yeah. I think that there is some kind of panic which is setting in, which is what we saw yesterday with the uh, raids on freelance journalists and contributors and young, uh, you know, uh, sub-editors and so on at News Click. And we also saw the uh, arrest today of Sanjay Singh. By the way, Rahul, I am sure you must be aware, the Enforcement Directorate, Told, said, told the court that they had added his name, Sanjay Singh's name, by mistake in the charge sheet on the lick up, uh, on the excise scam. And you know what they did? They sent a letter of apology. When was this? May 2023. Sanjay Singh subsequently said he will sue. He has in fact written to the finance that secretary is true. asking for right permission to prosecute the enforcement director, director, right about enforcement directorate director, and the deputy director. But had so the enforcement directorate bosses have a genuine reason to go after Sanjay Singh. Okay, so that let me just ask clear. you, there is one question which is very… to defer bail to Manish Sisodia. Okay, well, one very important question that Dr. Raman… It can be used to bail to Manish Sisodia, saying Dr. we found Raman, something now. One important follow-up question, now that you have completed. Look, I am very worried. You have said that this India block is an alliance of convenience. People have only come together, this is what you have said, to defeat Modi in one election. And therefore, are you suggesting? They have said it. I no. am not saying it. Okay, so they have said it. So you should not therefore. I am not saying it. They so have okay. themselves said it. Okay, so Dr. Dr. Raman, therefore, why is Modi worried? Because if it is such a transparently um, transactional relationship based on convenience and not conviction, the people will also see through it. So. He is not going to lose to the India block. The people will say, well, we are not going to vote for a bunch of people who might split right after. Some of them might, might even join the BJP. Dr. Raman, this is a… Uh, look, Rahul, the point… Yeah, it's yeah, a sham. The point really is that electorally, electorally, the BJP appears to be losing ground. No, and where? the fact that a common candidate against the BJP, well, in Maharashtra, in Karnataka, in Bihar, 
not Madhya necessarily Pradesh, sir extent, so there not are many necessarily places where the bjp let me let me fact ground. check you let me well, fact check you in uttar pradesh quote and two elections yeah. one was an assembly election not one was UP. a general election i said no no why rahul uttar i pradesh said uttar pradesh is Karnataka, the most no no one second sir Bihar, give me give, give me a second you Maharashtra. said that you said that when yeah. people come together and they put up one candidate it's going to be curtains for the bjp this has happened not once but twice in the most electorally significant state in the country uttar pradesh viewers in an assembly UP election you had and gujarat let me UP sir and gujarat are let me finish up sir, and gujarat are exceptions there exception even 24 they Can are I? going to be bjp sweep okay everything everything that uh, everything viewers that i can throw as a hard fact to puncture this argument is an exception so then one could easily turn around and say that the arguments of the aap are also an exception because after all viewers the ed can't be right in three other matters and wrong when it comes to the aam aadmi party so what is happening mr muni let me ask you an analyst with deep sympathies to the aam aadmi party what is happening here okay in bengal ed is uh, god and in delhi it becomes uh, goon how does this work you know rahul ji it's a pleasure meeting you my here and uh, discussing the topic with uh, you for the first time uh, uh coming on to the hard facts i'll give some facts only no other uh, rhetoric good age 49 vents were uh, you know uh, liquor vents were given out and pr- prior to the liquor policy there were 849 vents and there was tendering process where is a scam now waiting then what happens is that the ed says that there is 100 crores scam from which for 70 crore and now this is ed saying for the 70 crore they don't have any proof of for the 30 crore they have proof with somebody someone called rajesh joshi now rajesh joshi was got uh, he they said that rajesh joshi has got 30 crore from south uh, okay. liquor lobby fair enough now the rajesh joshi who and through rajesh joshi the money went to vijayanayak vijayanayak it went money went to kejriwal interestingly the rao avenue court gave a bail to rajesh joshi and say that there is not a iota of proof against him in this particular ed case you can check the facts so where is the 30 crore okay scam? so mr muni so there is Now, now, listen, listen, listen. Now, tell me. Now, uh, I just shoot one question to all my party. Where is the money? Not a single penny of money. I'll bring you back to, to what the court has said. Even there. with no recovery of proceeds, no. even with no recovery of proceeds, this was the court saying when Sisodia applied for bail. Doctor Ranganathan is pointing to the screen. With no recovery of proceeds, conduct amounts to involvement. Okay. Now, no other panelists yeah. might not know about it. You have asked them the question. Now, I'll let let me let me have five seconds more. Let me have five seconds more. Yeah, yeah. Now, this PML the the PML Act has this uh, section under them that apart from the onus of proving that innocent is on the accused, this is the PML Act, and that is what today Supreme Court has also said it to ED that you have got lots of power. So with power comes great responsibility. So this is the this is the for this you no, must this act. for this you must uh, blame your own ally the congress who under chidambaram came up with this draconian pmla act don't blame uh, the government concerned and this was also no, upheld I, by I the supreme court by the way this, this great uh, mantle of powers was CBI upheld by the free. supreme court one I second akash ji muni i just want to ask you you said okay all of this happened then why was this policy withdrawn why was I it withdrawn you many on of your show sir that this policy was withdrawn there's a long story on it if you give me five or four minutes i'll tell you that how many oh. uh, licenses were given I why the well i don't know because the court is still asking the aam aadmi party why is it in uh, been uh, withdrawn and we are yet to await a response from the aap in court the, so we'll wait the, for that you, no one second no, i don't know you are you are not I'll the aap you are not the aap let me let me bring in dr ranganathan one second that's not fair 